Here's a question for you. What's going on with your fans and advocates? Now we call this power user monitoring. I want you to picture that you have a software and inside that software, there's all kinds of what we'll call power users. These are the people that use your solution day to day. They're not the decision makers. So the decision makers are the one that cut the check for your solution, but it's the people that use your solution every day. These people are the ultimate champions. And a lot of times we focus on decision makers. We'll think about the CXOs and the VPs and we'll watch who got hired, who got promoted, who left. But we often forget about who actually influences how, as an example, software is purchased. It's purchased by people who love it. You see, when we have a challenge in sales or marketing or customer success or product, we turn to the teammates that are actually looking after that functional responsibility and task and say, is there a better, faster, cheaper alternative? And it's their past experiences that dictate the tools that we use. I'll tell you a little story. We once had a new CMO come into my company, Sales for Life. Now I had been an avid Salesforce user for 10 years. I actually vowed I would never change from Salesforce. Hired a new CMO. He was HubSpot certified. Within three months, he had convinced us we ripped out Salesforce and we brought in HubSpot. This is why power user monitoring is so critical to your success. They will influence your future deals. If you wanna know more, click book a call and let's talk about how to get you more at-bats.